What is macular degeneration? Well, it's degeneration of the macula. And it comes in two forms, wet and dry. With dry accounting for about 80% of cases and wet accounting for roughly the other 20. Dry macular degeneration typically presents with drusen deposits and gradual vision loss. And here's an example of what drusen looks like on a fundoscopic exam. Wet macular degeneration is much different as it is associated with increased VEGF secretion, which stimulates new vessel development. Both of these types of macular degeneration are associated with visual distortion. And to identify this, patients are asked to look at an Amsler grid and identify if they notice any distortion of the lines. Currently, there is no treatment for dry macular degeneration. However, a certain regimen of vitamins and antioxidants have been shown to be useful in prevention of dry macular degeneration. Wet macular degeneration is characterized by the VEGF secretion that stimulates new vessel development. So using anti-VEGF therapies like bevacizumab or ranibizumab are viable treatment options in wet macular degeneration.